My friends, welcome back. We are playing as the United Federation of Planets. Oh man, this series. Oh, this series, man. Oh, guys, you're amazing. You know that, right? If it wasn't for you, this series would never have gone off the ground the way it is. And I'm, I'm seriously hoping that once the Borg is done, because the Borg is eventually going to be our end goal, and I don't want to drag it out until you guys are like, yeah. Yeah, what are you doing? So, there is... There's a, 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 a large amount of ships in here. There's the Huskull. And I, I noticed a comment from Phoenix Lightning that these guys were definitely a scout of the uh, of the of the galaxy. And and even though they have some fleets in here, they have a sick, sick amount of fleets in here. You see that? A hundred almost a hundred and fifty. That's one, two, three. That that's just. This is a fallen empire. We have precious little time for your kind. Um, we're not there yet. We have a lot of things to do. Fighting a fallen empire is definitely going to be a thing, because there's a bunch of them, and some like me. Luckily for us, the Metron, as well as the First Federation, like us. Uh, as for the others, let's go with relative power, because then at least it's uh, it should be at the top. No, let's change that. Here we go. Oh, don't do this. Okay, fine. Um, some of these empires are just extremely strong, and they like us, and some just don't. Like, these guys, and the Voth is probably just not going to be enjoying us. The Keepers of Knowledge, eh, that's quite the Undy the Undyne is a trade league. Yes, I would like to purchase something. <laughs> oh, seriously. This game sometimes cracks me up. Uh, let's see, what else can we see over here? How about you? Yeah, you have nothing. Yeah, they were defeated. The Undyne has just been defeated. It's, uh, they're gone. They're gone, man. The Golden Concord is on the rise. There's so many subjects. I And I don't know. I don't know if we should keep integrating them. Since, well, it's, uh, it's a massive job. It's a massive undertaking. We still have to do all of these bases. We're just going to be building them up. As soon as they can. Just upgrade. Uh, until they're at full capacity. Because... Going back to all of these uh, these tiny little jobs that uh, just need to happen. Uh, Outbreak has ended, which is amazingly good. I like that. Civilian ship. Yo. Yeah, you did this. That's cool. Just go here and assist the research. Yo, you are over here. Oh, the Borg is in there. Well, let's send you... It doesn't really matter now, does it? Yeah, actually, it does, but it isn't as important at the moment. Considering, well, we have so much research. Go here. Go here and... Did I already select this planet to assist the research? I don't know. Well, uh, yeah, we did. Damn it. That means you, my friend, are... Can you go in here? Could you assist in, in here? Ah, that's a, I wish that that was actually a thing. That would have been nice. But it isn't. The Vega station. There you go. Assist the research over there then. Commercial pack. Still food is a bit of a problem. Um, we'll get it working. I still don't dare to press that button. Because this is actually... No, it's not in the building queue. Only he has two Excelsior class in the building queue. And you have a constitutional class. So, the f Fleet 4 is almost done. And Fleet 3 is working really hard. What are we lacking? Actually, we shouldn't be lacking anything. Okay, that's wrong. 3 of 4.
There you go. That should fix that. You're at full strength. You're at full strength. You're just weird. And you are at full strength. I think it's safe to assume that we can actually start work on the uh, on a new fleet. Because I want to have a fleet at every one of my shipyards. And that's why we're also making so many anchoring. I want to be able to um, go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Borg. Army training, fleet conscription, encourage free thought. No, no, I don't need that going. Uh, we're saving up our influence for the integration of... I don't know who we're integrating at the moment. Can't remember. There's just so much going on. Those we cannot integrate. We don't have anything for you. You're halfway there. Yeah, we just have to wait until all the shipyards are ready to... Uh, Oh, we also need to change your name. Starbase 28. Construction complete. So let's change that. Starbase 28 in the Bajor region. Upgrade you. you. Of course you had to you you have to be a trade depot. Even though you could also be a military post. But it's that it's that wormhole. The natural wormhole we have to deal with. We are ready. They are just not interested. Look at... They are, of course, getting a bit happier. But they are not friendly. It's that they are so pathetic. They are coral. Otherwise, they would have been hostile towards us. Which is not, uh, not bad either. Let's just get rid of this. So, where are you all heading to? So, you're in the soul. You are in here which makes well no sense at all the game is a bit lagging at the moment you are starbase 2 let's get our shipyards open starbase 2 and you are at starbase 14 that means that the second fleet should be at starbase 13 yes you should be well you're upgrading right now so i will allow it but you are heading out. You're heading home. You need to um, defend your own station, Y Gamer. Not, not, not the entire galaxy. Shall we just uh, do that upgrade? Shouldn't be taking too long. It's just one ship that needs an upgrade. So you're all done. Technology discovered. You're all done. We got three new technologies at the bloody same time. Wow. I like this. I um, I need it. Let's take it. And another upgrade, another ship is retired, guys. Damn. Planetary building speed. Uh, let's get the campus. And we got... Yeah, the Challenger, the Nigeria, and the New Orleans class. Oh, I, I think that should be the final ones. Don't tell me we get a new flagship because it's just too soon we're in 7k research 7k that's sick let's get the cheap option here so let's take a look we have a new frigate and yeah i like that finally took took them long enough what's this yeah sure why not save that also auto upgrade that would be cool Fine, yeah, here you go. The light cruiser. Three engines these times, huh? Sweet. Uh, here's the new Orleans flag. Oh, actually, it's not a flagship, but it, it it's starting to look like the Voyager. Voyager classes. Don't tell me there's another flagship in here. That would be horrible. Actually, <laughs> I would really be disappointed if that happened. I know, it, it makes no sense, but still, when we have to change all of these fleets again. They look cool, I really like the look of them. This is actually the, uh, I think this is the next generation era or the Voyager era. I'm not sure yet. Maybe there's something in here. Yeah, this is um, spatial emplacement, so that's the him. So we don't have to change you. The heavy cruiser. I think it is time that we um, 
Yeah, we might have to change you. Because you are no longer of this time, mate. You're, you're so strong. That's, that's what's... That's been why I'm not trying to get rid of it. Because he is so bloody strong. He might be the strongest ship that I currently have. The Enterprise D. No, guys, there's no change here. So I'm still happy about that. Scientist ship, well, we'll have to get other retrofits. So what's the, the strongest ship? 301. Oh, wait a minute. The advanced cruiser is, is as strong. But also, you are not of this age anymore. I can't wait. So there's definitely a more ship upgrades. That's so cool. Are you still upgrading? Yes, you are. What is your... Yeah, you probably have ships that just... Are no longer of this uh, of this era, man. That That's your problem. The Excelsior class is being done. But the Ambassador class is out. So, let's give you the newest of the newest ships. Excelsior class, Nebula class. Do we have that? Let's give you... More of them. Hey, you're probably going to be one strong ass fleet though. Let's um, make sure we get that all going. Nine ships. That means that we are. Yeah, we should be going for the next fleet. But. That would not make sense, right? Okay, let's take a look here. So we need that. We need this one. You. Constitutional class. Mm, I, I kind of want to keep it at these ships. Let's see how we can do this. Yeah, he is strong. He definitely is strong. 8k. And we are at 293. Which is not bad. Let's go and reinforce that new fleet. We're going to get the fifth fleet. And I think eventually... My question to you, friends, is... Um, are we waiting for the Borg to attack us? Or are we going to do a preemptive strike as a, they are a galactic threat? We also are getting a lot of uh, unity. But it still takes forever. Dial mm. blockers, yeah. Okay, I just want to get what 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 would we get? Yeah, maybe we should go for galactic contenders. We'll just have to see how that will all go. Uh, food is negative five, so we're actually very very close. Are you at Starbase fourteen? No, you're not. I want you to go home. You are at home. Are you the only fleet, only ship in my fleet that is currently at dock? No, you just don't have. No, you just don't have that one building that I would really like you to have. Crew quarters. Because I'm now losing money for no reason. And that's usually not what people like to see. So we'll change that. Um, I can speed up. It hardly changes a thing, though. So, yeah, don't expect too much out of this. Construction complete. Let's see. You can all go back. Yeah, you have a long way to go. Defending in the Klingon borders. And the 5th fleet, where do we place that? So let's take a look. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 14, Starbase 17 would be the next. Uh, to boldly go, apparently something's weird. Where is Starbase 17? So we need one over here. Let's send a scientist. Are we still, we're still building the Galactic class flagship. Where are you? Go to. Uh, also, we are unable to send the uh, the flagship, of course. We need some scientists in there. I'm 
Where are they? You. And what's up with the... Um, oh, the paranoid. I was uh, under the impression he was a substance abuser. 600 and some odd days. He is... Not going to be in time. Carol Marcus. Um, you are going to get the honor. Yeah, you're just going to arrive there. Just in the nick of time. We need to get... I know there's one over here. But we need to spread out our scientists a bit more. There's too many in here. You. Go over here. And assist the research there. And let's close this off again. Can we add new ships now? Uh, we actually could add a few. Actually, we only can add one of these two. Let us go and talk with... Mm. Wait, these are some of my subjects. Right? Kaylor, the Lydian Despia, the Bolian League. And the Bolian is just one, one of these annoying planets. Let's go with the Bolian. High aggressive, of high intensity. You are at full strength, which is something I really like to see. Okay, let's keep the game running. Let's take a look. Once all of the fleets are done, how much? We will adapt. Yeah, they're, they're superior. They're still superior. They definitely outnumber us. Okay, what is up with your starbase? We have crew quarters. So, oh, that's praise cleared. New tech, mining station cost. Army health, Armageddon is back. Uh, photon torpedoes, let's go with photon torpedoes. Since uh, we do want to boost the strength of our fleet. And who died? Sarlacc has died. That's a bit of a shame. And we're, at, we're in the plus again, awesome. Construction complete. Let's take a look here. Um, yeah, we need to focus on, on getting population. Yeah, there's just one row to go. There you go. It will take a good amount of years. Once again, negative, but it's due to everything else. We should get more people. Potentially by selling alloys or other resources if we can. We have so much latinum. We're making 41 latinum. Uh, that means that we can, we, we can trade one latinum for 11 energy. So that's, that's it's about 600 energy just lying around and not doing anything. Let's see. Can we... Oh, I have to go through all of the buildings now, do I? Oh, that's going to be... Do we have that on Earth? It's just costing the one. So if you see the actually like this specialization, no, it's not specialization. It's this one, import. Our dilithium is going down really fast, and the nitrate is also going down. Let's do that. So you don't have it. You don't have it. Some of them will have it. Oh, that's annoying. Let's see, Pajem. Pajem has it, for sure. Okay, what else? Mm. I'm actually quite... Okay with all of the rest. So let's just boost money. 
Yeah, and I'll, I'll definitely finish this in between episodes because it's uh, it's annoying. It's tedious. I, I can envision that people are like, yeah, uh, you should have done this the minute you got that building. And I'm like, yeah, it's a hundred planets <laughs> and we do get a lot of them. Uh, anyways, let's let's do this in between episode, guys. So I don't bore you to death with that. Oh, so we are preparing. That's basically it. It is getting very, very close at our engagement with the Borg. That additional fleet is most likely pushing us over the threshold that we need, that we seek, that we uh, are going to use to fight the Borg. The, uh, one of the final, final things that we will do in this series. And of course the game is lagging. <laughs> oh damn. Yeah, some of the devs are, uh, are, are very annoyed with the fact it's been lagging as much. It's not something they can change guys. It's, it's definitely the base game that's been a bit of an issue. Um, but we know. 2.6. The uh, performance upgrade. I'm looking very much forward to it. Let's just end the episode of here so I can do that uh, off, off camera stuff. Complete. And I'll see you tomorrow, guys. Have a good one. Bye bye. Initiating communications.